Hello. Hope you're cozy because it's time for episode 15 of Perfect Dark. Um, so I think the volume's pretty good. I think the game volume was a bit loud on the last episode, so I turned it down a couple of decibels. So hopefully it balances out better this episode. <laughs> I guess we'll keep tweaking it until it's the best. But I, it should be better now. You should be able to hear me a little bit more. I don't think it was that bad last episode, but I think the balance was a little bit off. I was, wasn't was too loud, but not loud enough. I don't know. Now the game volume should be a little bit quieter and my mic should stand out a bit more, but not that much. I guess we'll find out. So next mission, Carrington Villa. Save the negotiator. Oh yeah, this is the sniper one. Eliminate rooftop snipers. Activate wind generator. Rescue Carrington. What's what's the difference here? Is it just harder? Okay. I don't know what's different. So it's sort of timed, right? Yeah. Oh, not used to this. Huh. Abort! <laughs> Hello there! <laughs> we just started, right? Episode just started? Got to be quick or they'll kill the negotiator. I can't. I'm trying my best. Help! I like shot all around him. Can I get the rooftop snipers now? They show up later. Okay. I don't know what the R tracker does? Can't remember. That was a false start. Nobody saw it. We got some Turok music. Didn't shoot at all. Just kind of laid there. Cover doesn't do much if you don't do anything with it. Are they just expecting me not to see them? Oh, there it goes. That's weird. Supposed to be like that? Oh, he took two hits there. Good job. Not good enough though. Sometimes the weapons, I have no idea where they go. I have a feeling these snipers are going to be a bit hard. Rooftop snipers. Take cover! Hmm. What does this do? Crouch. Oh, okay. It's weird. I'm going to cover. Are you? Take her down. Where's your cover? Why you? The song is so like casual. Nice beats. Of that kind of, uh, uh, I guess it does. Oh, leg, here we go. Nice. 
Snipers versus sniper, here we go. We're doing good. No one's here? Okay. Are there any goodies back here? No? We don't have an escort we have to worry about. Look up. Ugh. Sometimes, sometimes I do good, sometimes I do bad. Like, what is this? Does the square in the middle change based on your zoom settings? Let's find out. If I do this. Yeah, it does. Oh, that's cool. Like the aim box, it's big. And when I zoom, it'll shrink. Neat. Neat. Look up. I need you to look up. Oops. Think I can get him? I think so. Get a objective clear yet, so hello. I keep trying to use the C sticks, not the C sticks, the C buttons to look around when I'm zooming. I don't know why. here. Getting the rooftop boys. What? Why can I still target it? Does that count with other bodies? I don't know. What are these guys special units? That their bodies are always targetable. Zoom is actually pretty good in this game. Compared to like what, Turok? Where it's like, fog is like a meter in front of you. So, the wind generator turbine is what it was like in the basement or something if I remember correctly. I'm something, but took him out before he could finish. Can I go through the front doors? I sure can. They didn't lock it or anything. Hey, oh, hello. Hold up. You guys want to step out? Oh, look at him go. He's dancing. He's a dancing boy. Moves weren't hot enough though. I don't think I really need the sniper anymore, but I'm saving my CMP ammo. Hello? I shot him in the arm. Whoops. Computers does Carrington have? Oh, 
in a bit of nightmare. Oh boy. Look at him go. Was, is he injured? Look at him. <laughs> wow. What? They're like a bunch of clowns. What's going on here? Pick up. Yeah, there you go. Oh my God. Just line him up. Is this the bathroom? Yeah. Wait, wait it's a bedroom. Never mind. Sniper rifle's not that strong. Where did the other guy go? Hello. I sure did. Nice little kitchen. Looked at it before. I think we should be good, right? Just swap over. Yeah, look at that ammo. wall for weird a weird separation wall why would you have that so where do we have to go again hey, you. <laughs> where that guy kind of came from we're still alive oh what was a little jiggeroo he did a little jig Sidestep. Just going for a little swim? Oh. Don't mind me. How do I... How do? Carrington, if your house wasn't so big, this would be a lot easier. I might have to go outside. Hmm. I don't think this takes me anywhere. I just went in a circle. There's someone here! Outside. Got it. Was that in front of me or to the my right? In front of me. Oh, you got me. Good job. Good shot. Much better than your friends. Cooling systems, power. This kind of reminds me of that Half-Life mission in, like, the silo. You have to cut the cooling and the power on to take out those long, big, smashing aliens, whatever they're called. Ooh, what was happening with the shadow there? He just ran right into that, huh? Nice. Rescue Carrington. I recall a wine cellar at some point. Here's where they must be holding Daniel. Uh oh, that's not good.
Okay. Door's locked. I think that's where he is. We gotta get a key. Wasting good wine. There's gotta be more. I can't tell what's a bottle and what's a person. That's a person. Oh, he's right there. Hello. Didn't realize he ran so quick. I'm gonna get him through the wine bottles. Is he dead? What is he doing? Oh, he's facing the other way. I'm like, what is he? Is he pulling down the new weapon? Is he gonna stay there? Where is he? Did that work? Sure did. Boom. Door key, there we go. Sir, nice. Are you injured? No, John, I'm okay. But those data dine thugs made me tell them where I'd hidden Dr. Carroll. Only I'd held out for a few minutes more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We actually did really good. That went really well. It's only been like 15 minutes. Like, I could start the next episode, but I don't think all missions are going to go that way. So maybe we go... Um, what should we do? Should I, like, run through this and just get an idea of what I have to do? No, let's leave it. Let's go... Let's go back. I don't know, do some tests. We did them all. We, did, we haven't done all the shooting gallery thing. Yeah, I kind of stopped doing the shooting gallery thing because like if they're all over the place in all the episodes, you can't really know which episode to look in to watch them. So for the bronze level ones, we can do them on random ah, episodes. I saw agent. What else? Thinking... At I'm the... sure I don't need to tell you what to shoot at. Yes, yes. I was thinking at the end of the playthrough, do some bonus episodes that are just to finish off these training stuff. Like the silver and the gold levels. So we can do the bronze ones. I see we did some three stars already. So I think we can do some bronze level ones, because they're not going to be as exciting and interesting, maybe, as the silver and gold. Yeah, let's do bronze ones, and then end of the let's play, we'll do the silver and gold ones. I think that makes the most sense. So we need goal score 120 in two minutes. Are you gonna flip? What's going on? Bronze, yeah. See, that's not too, too hard, right? So, same idea, except we have a scope this time. Okay. I'm always worried to shoot if it like moves or turns around or something. Make sec four. This is yeah, okay. Excellent shot power at the cost of accuracy. Good. Especially when used in the three round burst secondary mode. The series drawback to the weapon is a limited magazine size. Okay. It's got. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the accuracy is not very good. Did I do it? Okay. You could tell the accuracy was not good at all. Ooh, the mauler. Typical Skedar weapon. Sacrificing some of the magazine, the shot can be charged up. Yep. That came in handy. Large ammo capacity is a bonus. It 
so loud. The loads go low. What is this? Oh, okay. Two different delivery systems for the rounds. It fires a standard shot or an explosive round. Ooh. Mayan engineers managed to do this without compromising the energy usage of the weapon. Nice. The fire rate is reduced. 90 in two minutes. Hmm. Curious. Oh. Good. Do I want to use the explosive? Okay, that wasn't too bad. Probably can get tricky later. CMP, we're quite familiar with this. Should I be shooting like that? I should have reloaded earlier. Whoops. Is one behind? Oh, okay. I, need to, I don't think I'll need all that, right? Yeah. <laughs> one shot left. Cyclone. Submachine gun. Specifically designed not to be accurate. Wow. Okay. Though it is worth your time practicing. It can put a lot of bullets out in a short time. Okay. Wait, I don't remember this. Oh yeah, okay. I don't think I've used this very often. Okay. I think I used it once. I was thinking this was the a different weapon. Oh, it's this one. It's a machine gun with an interesting secondary mode, a high velocity bullet that can penetrate objects easily. It's reduced during the secondary mode. This is, yeah, okay. Ooh, 480. Oh, I think it wants us to use the penetrating one. Who needs it? RCP120. Special mineral bullet that coupled with a high fire rate and a huge magazine makes this a perfect tool to be used against the Skedar. Is this the secret weapon that Carrington made? Should the need arise? The bolts can be used to fuel a prototype cloaking device. The training has been altered to reflect this particular... Wait. The bullets can be used to fuel a prototype cloaking device. What does that mean? Cloaking device, interesting. Does it matter? I don't know. Maybe they maybe the um in the silver and gold ones, they only turn around when you're cloaked or something. I don't know. Laptop gun. Fold up to resemble a laptop PC, but it can be deployed as a sentry gun. I don't think we're going to be practicing that. Okay, sure. Dragon. Data Dine. U.S. Military. Here's a proximity mine. Yep. Oh. Help. Loads quick. Two minutes. Ooh. 
Squid. K7 Avenger. Secondary mode of this weapon seems to be a threat identifier targeting oh targeting mines, hidden explosive devices such as the dragon in secondary mode and automatic guns. Huh. So that's what it does. Too small. Okay. Is it gonna move? No. Ninety percent accuracy. AR thirty-four. Fairly basic assault rifle. Secondary mode is a permanent zoom. Oh, so you can run around. Testing is weighted towards accuracy training. Oh, I see. So you're supposed to. Maybe, um, should try to put in a zoom? Interesting, okay, so then I can get in, get in the right spot and move around with it, okay. Super Dragon, how many more? We have about four minutes, five minutes? Okay. Heavier variant of the dragon. Let's play small grenade launcher. Not hard to see my yeah. Use the test to get used to the grenade trajectory. Do I? Maybe in silver and gold? Let's find out. Should I use this? I don't think it's a good idea. I probably wasted that target. Yeah. Am I gonna have enough now? Let's find out. Yeah, I don't know if you want to use grenades on that. Yeah. Reaper. This is the gun I was thinking about for the RCP or whatever. D designed for a far stronger user than a human. Kneeling down, ooh. Not find it. Barrels can be used as a grinder, right? Yeah. If I should have slowed down or not. Like as long as I get a third. Yeah. Whoops, yeah, I should have reloaded. Enough? Yeah, I think we're fine. Take, we're running out of time though. Should explode soon? Yep. Okay. Unload. Oh, reload. Oh, we got more ammo. Okay, we don't have to worry about ammo. Okay. Okay. I was thinking, I was watching the ammo as well. I was like, oh. One more, and then I think we'll end it there. Sniper rifle, we just use this. Turn. It's hard to turn well. Turn. Nice. 
quick. But yeah, we still have a bunch. There's so many weapons in this game, that's cool. They even have the mines and stuff. Neat. Uh, yeah. So let's end it there. Get up. And we will continue the next mission in the next episode. And if we finish that one early, we'll do some more training. Otherwise, the silver and gold training missions will be at the end of the playthrough. I have decided. Unless I change my mind again later. I don't know. Who knows? Anyways, that will be it. Thanks for watching and see you later.